it's time to go play a game. A game of oblivion. They were aristocrats, entitled and sustained by a greed for power. Having been involved in the foundation of Umbrella, the Ashford family had also independently performed research on the Veronica virus. However, 15 years ago, Alexander Ashford disappeared under mysterious circumstances. To make things worse, Alexander's daughter Alexia, a child prodigy who played a key role in the research, died at a young age. Her untimely demise brought an end to the Veronica project. And the Umbrella Files show that all research was apparently lost. The Ashford lineage gradually lost its power to the corrupt hands of the Umbrella Corporation. Alexia's brother, Alfred, was demoted to a mere supervisor, and he was sent to command a private detention facility on an isolated island in the Southern Seas, alone. I feel like this year may be special. Hello, Alfred. Don't you, Alexia? It's almost like there's something I'm forgetting. Alright, I like your voice actor better. My dear Alfred. Oh. Please be easy on yourself. Karen Strassman. Why don't you set down your burdens and play a game with me? You're right, Alexia. Since you've come back, I've never been this happy. Oh yeah, and of course Alfred's voice by Richard Cancino. Oh! Just for future reference. Uh oh. That's Kenshin! It's an attack on the island! By Umbrella? Or, no, by Wesker's organization. The organization. And there's Steve! Damn it! <gasps> Which way? Sam Regal! Uh, wait! I wasn't trying to escape, I just... The alarm sounded and the door unlocked. I thought... That I... Rockford uh, Prison, uh, detainee 267. <laughs> Guess you're not with Umbrella, then, are you? Nope. Damn. I'm Claire Redfield. Damn, girl. You scared me. Eyes forward. <laughs> so, what's your name? My name's Steve. <laughs> well, what do you know? Love at first gun sight. You don't look like one of them, Claire. They get you, too? Yeah. You could say that. What's happening on this island? Yes, Game of Oblivion, a retelling of Co Veronica. In my opinion, Someone a much better one. Caused a biohazard. Yeah, it, in my Bio opinion, hazard. it's actually much, much better than its original game as a whole because original game had some serious. I don't have time issues. to explain everything. Oh my God, it's a backtracking. I need ther I need therapy well, almost every day due to all the backtracking. Huh? Detected alert! It's them! Yep. Let's shoot them down! Why are they after us? Look, you got two choices here. Kill or be killed. Let's no see. Call. Uh I'll kill. They're nice they're infecting. Options. What do you expect? Well the, he doesn't know that. I hope you know how to use that thing. But by the way, he's using a Luger. And we're playing as Claire for this chapter. Since I Since I chose her for this one because in Game of Oblivion, Claire gets more grenade launcher rounds, and Steve, true to form, gets some machine gun rounds. How many are there? How many are there? Fair few, apparently. Maybe about hundreds of zombies on this island alone. Come on, this way. Considering how many prisoners and soldiers are on. And it's a fucking island. But yeah, he's using a Luger. One Luger. Is it the gold one? This must be nope. a detention facility. Yeah. This is where I was locked up. Anyone else? He must have picked you? that off a guard. Yeah, yeah that already just it's just to the remind us of the right gold lookers. I have no idea what caused this. Mm. And yes, There's Steve is voiced by Sam Regal, aka the voice of Teddy ever since Persona 4 around. Arena. There are three. The guards oh. had them. Only used them for games. Oh, and porn too. Daggers. Maybe I'll be able to find out what <laughs> yeah. Oh, I, well, I mean, I, you I, gotta I, have something to do on this island. Yeah, yeah, especially since you know, you come home hey, from the execution going? grounds you one Saturday night, if you don't want to. and I then know. you have to deal with a guy who's like, "I'm not talking to my sister dolls. I'm not talking to my sister dolls." Did you watch me playing with my sister dolls? No, sir. I didn't see you playing with your sister dolls again. Good. Full speed ahead. But this island can't move. I will find a way. Oh God. Not again. 
Yeah. Um, I don't like you that. What are we gonna be dealing with? Uh, a lot worse things, Steve. Well, I'm. All right, here we go. I hope he ain't graboids. Uh, there's one in chapter three, of course. Ugh. Well, they had one hell of a party. I know it's a mess. But won the poker game. Feel free to make yourself at home. <laughs> oh God. Yeah. Uh, the here? infection was very bad here, apparently. I wish I knew. I took off without looking back. This must have been a truly powerful strain there if they is. did this much damage. Either that was just a powerful attack because the airstrike was the thing that unleashed the T virus. It, you know, it destroyed the containment here on the island. But somehow Claire is not infected, nor Steve. What was that? They're both lucky. I think it was just the or unlucky in this case. Look, what are you trying to find out anyway? Uh, that's not really who bad. are the Patriots. Wrong. Yeah, I know. But... Hey. Sorry, I'm going at my own pace. Great. <laughs> now I got to deal with this girl's power trip on top of everything. Hey, watch your mouth. She knows more about this than you. Albeit, it's only been three months, so she's still rather shell shocked. Oh, Not to mention that she's dealing with this again. Jesus Christ. Did we make it in time? Was he your cellmate? I can't even tell anymore. Oh my. But yeah, you can definitely tell that compared to Umbrella Chronicles, they want to emphasize uh, hey, the horror aspect. I think we should go back. I have a bad feeling about this. Yeah, yeah me too. Ah, wow. <laughs> Thanks, Claire. Huh? Hello. So that's what's been making all the noise. Uh, ah! Get back! It's a dead end. Well, we'll take this guy out. This way's not either. That? Jesus! Thankfully, the zombies are just as powerful as the other zombies that we dealt with, though. So. At least, it's a. It's not the Code Veronica <laughs> zombies. Hiding. Yeah, it's the it's the uh, BOWs I'm more, more more worried about. Well, true that, but I mean, considering how easy it There's was to get killed in Code Veronica, yeah. Yeah, considering the fact that uh, there are no difficulty options in the English releases of Code Veronica, they were in the Japanese version. Uh, very easy, easy, and normal. I think I should tell you exactly how difficult Code Veronica truly is. Oh joy. Why not give him a hand? Ah! Ugh. No time for jokes! <laughs> oh, but he's Sam Regal. He's one of the many budget masters that exist in video games. This whole thing's getting unbearable! Oh yeah, oh my god, he's also a bright peacock. Ah. Isn't he? Monokuma, yes. And is he also... Uh... Ah! Yeah. Is he also, hey, uh... What's his name from, uh, Digimon Tamers, uh... Takata? Yeah. Oh, oh yeah. Oh, heck. Hey, Mickey, look at no C! <laughs> and... <laughs> In hell! Yeah, yeah. Ugh. I find his jokes, while they're kind of black humor, in a way, it's his way of completely, how, you know, keep himself cool them all. from freaking the fuck out and running around Pretty like good, an idiot. Huh? Hmm. Well, you're not a complete waste. <laughs> oh! Snide. <laughs> oh. I hope this still works. Oh, well, let's use the computer. Hey, we found a computer room. Looks like my brother was never even here. Umbrella probably doesn't know where he is either. What did he do? Why are they after him? I don't know. But he's been missing for three months. I was in Paris looking for him. I broke into one of Umbrella's labs. But I got caught. And you were sent here? 
What about you? What's your story? It's personal. Uh, it's dumb. You don't want to know. It really is. <laughs> just tell me. It's not just dumb, it's sad. I didn't even do anything. Some other jackass screwed up. Landed the two of us in here. Hmm? So we're in the Southern Hemisphere. Mm hmm Yeah. So you don't know much about this place, do you? Apparently some noble family owned the joint. The Ashfords. That's Alfred. He's the only surviving member. Rumor has it, he went mad from loneliness. But why would anyone want to bomb this place? For the virus. Anyway, I've got to contact Leon. He'll come for us. It's much more simple than you think. Well, we're gonna see if Wesker wants uh, Alexia's research. All to himself. And for the benefit of his organization. Yep. Oh, great. Well, they, it looks like they found the computer room, too. <laughs> wow, they had better luck than Vector did. And Shadow. And Steve is not having door. a good day. No, I ain't. We don't know where it goes. <laughs> and once again, the I do. Yeah, once again, the banter between Claire and Steve. I miss they it. Stop following us. Well, what can I say? Claire's got a nice ass in this game. <laughs> Boy, <laughs> that's all you can focus on. <laughs> Something's in here. Although that being said, uh, Claire looks. She has the eyes of a rookie. <laughs> I'M HERE ALL WEEK! That being said, uh, she does look vastly different compared to how she did in Memories of a Lost City. Yeah. Oddly, it looked like she grew an inch or two. Yeah. And her face, too. Oh, uh, by the way, actually, that reminds me. I believe that, uh, that! Nope, this, sec this sector is a sector of- nope. Please do not invalidate the note. So much note. Uh, but yeah, as I was trying to say, um, Claire's overall likeness in Resident Evil 2 and Co. Veronica is based on Nev Campbell and Liv Tyler's respectively. <laughs> yeah, Alice Cord actually said it herself. Yo, oh, Jesus! While they may not do Code Veronica levels of damage, they sure know how to, to do Zerg Rush. Yep. Right. We'll find another route from there. Uh, you're doing pretty good on the headshots, though. Well, yeah, well, yeah, I'm compensating for the straight. shaky cam, yes. Nothing but a solitary cell down that way. Ah. Uh oh, uh oh. Up. The, the only person I could think that would, well, would be Rodrigo, I think. Yeah. That'd be the only thing there, but we're buying that. Although he does get at least mentioned in the archives. Yeah, because the hemostatic you find is an item you can collect in the game, and Rodrigo is mentioned. Alright, let, let's go! Phew! Oh, look at that, I like the, the little uh, barcode that's on uh, Steve's arm to further brand him as a prisoner. That might be our way out of here. Let's find out. The lullaby. And believe it or not, that's actually Karen Strassman singing it, re recording the, the vocals. Huh. Is that. Is that what? Alexia. Wait. Though then again, we already—if you've already you watched Code Veronica, you really know who she that must is. Must be out of her yep. mind singing a lullaby at a time like this. Out of her mind. That's exactly. That's an understatement. Oh, you got to be kidding That's me. If... <laughs> I should have just left you alone too. <laughs> <laughs> Real charmer there. Your fans are here. <laughs> 
<laughs> if this is the Steve Burnside fan club, then I'm quitting. No rest for the wicked. Oddly, I think the only fans are the zombies. Oh, no rest for the wicked. Nice reference, uh, Steve. Because Carlos only got to say that line in Resident Evil 3 if he went uh, out of the trolley by jumping. Did you hear that? Huh? Uh -oh. Sounds like maybe a bird? Not a bird. More like. BATS! Knife him! Can't look at this. Holy crap! I think that wall by woke him up. No. Uh, hear that, or they're just pissed. I would say they're pissed. Oh, oh boy. And I thought everybody liked Vanna. You'll nope. I can feel it. You, you can feel it in your bones. Who are you, Robin? Perhaps. Oh god, I just imagined Steve and a Robin suit. <laughs> it oddly fits! Oh god. Huh? So, uh. There's that girl now? Ah! Oh boy. Thankfully, they don't seem to attack in too much. Although, you, you, if, you, you, if you're good, if you're lucky, you get lots of bats with shotguns. Yes. Oh, boom! Yeah, we blew enough ammo. Let's get the hell out of here. Right. Yeah, you'll go wherever she's going. I know you, Steve. Anyway, we're on to chapter two. That woman. Speaking of Steve, you're not playing as Steve. I won't be surprised if we find her dead body. <laughs> that would actually be reasonable. And and under most reasonable circumstances. The yeah, Steve gets 160 rounds but compared to 120 for the submachine gun that we pick up. Uh, Are we paradigm shifting? No. Wrong game. Although there is, there is something I do like is the fact that uh, when when it, when you're uh, too close to zombies in a uh, yeah, like, look at that. See, there's blood and rain and even drool at times on the camera. It's a nice, disgusting feature that you can appreciate the extra touches. Yeah, it's like see like the rain. Yeah, it actually looks good. Yep. Compared to most games these days. Uh, yeah, I was trying to wait for a counterattack, but oh well. Hmm. Oh, there's a this building must is stare at everything else. Oh. Here comes the welcoming party. Let's uh, let's run. Get inside. Here we go. Welcome to the Palace of Insanity, once again. Again, that music, too. Is this that woman's house? <coughs> Not sure. It's one hell of a house, though. Quite. <gasps> what was that? Creepy. Yeah, monsters, zombies. And things that go bump in the night. Like someone extremely insane and loopy and fruity. Yeah. It's locked. That's Alpha for ya. Oh. <laughs> Surprise! I, I, I'm not like. for my grand debut. I'm the. Uh, dick. <laughs> I don't know. Oh, but yeah, that guy had a bow gun, by the way. Yeah. Oh, hello. Uh, oh, see you. Go down. Thank you. I'm hoping to at least get one counterattack eventually. In fact, I do as Steve in one of the chapters. Footsteps? Oh. Is someone there? There is. 
We have to go check. But again, you know, the remastered, rearranged tracks from the original games <coughs> are just fantastic. Especially this one and the suspended doll when we get to chapter 5. Actually, no, chapter 4. Game of Oblivion has seven chapters. Steve, look at this. That's her. Alexia Ashford. Wait, she was part of the Ashford family? It says here she died in 1983. That's 15 years ago. Hmm. Huh. You said Alfred then was the Then why only is she out wandering life? about? Then again, I have no idea. <laughs> Speaking of fruit, feels like we're walking into a trap. I can't believe we're following the singing voice of a dead woman. Well, it could be worse. She could be following a banshee. We can always it could be worse. It could be anything. a piano playing music, but there's nobody at the piano. Oh, we see plenty of that in other games. Uh, Chorus party, for instance. And then heaven no flung at you too. Mm. God, that music box. What the hell is this? Um, the music box is too near there. Antique music box. What's it doing here? Oh, and tea. Oh, great. Hot. It's still warm. <laughs> Something's not right about. Huh. Oh my God, no. This again. Oh God. They even used the same footage. Yeah. Well, if it ain't broke, they'll fix it. It's her again. I don't know say this little bit right here is actually very impressive. Wait, uh, that technical boy, scale, you know? Is that Alfred? Is that her brother? Yeah. You gotta even that is impressive on a technical scale. Yeah. What are they doing? What are they doing? Torturing a dragonfly and looking at each other very longingly, very creepily. I think we've seen enough to know that this isn't a good idea. Yeah, I think it's time to go. <laughs> <laughs> what? Can't handle Team Wincess? Oh! Isn't that nice? He waited for us. Oh, then again, Steve has no idea that he has no intelligence. Wait, I was waiting for a counterattack. What can I say? I want a counterattack to happen. Eh, yeah, well. Yeah, I'm going for two. The Ashford twins as team wins us because yeah, might as well. I guess even though the relationship is far from that, it's one-sided. Alfred always loved his sister, but Alexia treated him like a master would a slave. And speaking of Alfred, look out! Ah! Damn, that was too close. Cause he's a very good shot. I. I'm Alfred Ashford, son of Alexander Ashford. That's him. Why have you come to disturb us? Was it you? Was it you who spread that wretched virus across my island? That's got nothing to do with us. Look, we all need to get out of here right now, okay? <laughs> Ooh. She has only just now returned to me. <laughs> Why would I want to leave? Who? You mean Alexia? <laughs> she always did enjoy playing games. And she has come up with the most splendid game for us to play. Games? If you survive our challenge, I will personally present you with a getaway plane as your prize. Ooh, take a key for coming in. Ready? Let the game begin! Yep, the game of oblivion. Come on, run! Run, my little rats! You're sitting down oh, great. here like this! Karando has turned stopping. against us. You need to fire back. But for the record, he was using suppressive fire. He wasn't firing blindly. He was literally trying to keep us away from shooting him. But again, that's what you would do too if you were a sniper. 
Ah. And those shots hurt. Yes, they do. They take maybe a quarter of your health, or maybe a fifth of it off. Don't you love this game? But, but wait, well, see, you what wanted us to fight humans. Well, here you go. Aren't you happy? This is the closest ah. we get. Yep. Steve, I'm not gonna die here. <laughs> ah, nope. Two shots. That's all it takes. So well, my little. Well, it's something, you know. You son of a. Yeah. Stop. Uh, damn it. Damn it! You think if Alfred was smart, he would just wait right there, like while you're distracted with the zombies, and then try to shoot you? Oh, but that would take the fun out of the game. Fuck. See? Logic! <laughs> Finally, the game beat you at your own game! The game must go on. Come to the training field for your next challenge. If you win, I'll let you leave the island. The training field? That place. You can't trust him. This is obviously a trap. I know. But I don't think we have much choice here. Uh. We either stay here and possibly die or catch him and find out how to get off this island. It's one or the other. All right. Let's get this over with. Now you're talking. I'm no rat, and I'm gonna make that very clear to him. We're not rats in a maze with no cheese to find. Yeah. Well, we'll show him how to deal with street rats. Well, let's get on magic carpet and kick his ass. Or in this case, would it be would not we be more akin to sewer rats at this point? Maybe so, but I I don't think that'd be a good mutation. Oh. They were waiting for us! Damn it! Go left! What? I can't hear you! Left! Left! Go back the same way we came! Oh, Jesus. Two more of them? Okay. <laughs> yeah, sometimes you just hang there limply. Dead again, there's, <laughs> dead there's zombies. Keep an eye out. Okay! We'll be fine. There's the training field he was talking about. Yeah, to the left, over there. Ooh, shotgun. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. What was that? Bad news. I think I know who that is. Oh, yeah. It ain't the, uh... It ain't the boogie bad. Seriously. Hold still. We need some junkers here. Oh, a hunter! It's not a zombie! Nope. Worse! Yeah, it's a hunter too! What kind of freak show is this place? They're quickening! No, they're Start Wesker's fighting. hunters! Actually, the wrath of Wesker. Oh, counterattack! There we go! Take that! Boom! Fuck him up! Nice dropkick! Yeah, that feels like a reused asset. Who cares? Then again, you need a zombie that did a drop kick. Uh, go away. Uh, by the way, also, again, partner scouts will help you with counter attacks too. Another one! Nope. Always aim for the head. Or at least near the main body, if any. No, the head. See you guys in chapter 3.